What is up, boys? Welcome back to another video. Today on the channel, we have ourselves a rewind of the legend, the icon, Thierry Henry. As you guys can see, I have finally updated the set up a little bit. I'm actually going to actually gonna hide the chat just to kind of show off the brand new background which is again still in pog progress we now have the full grass on the walls we have the like lights on the the side I, I can't physically point to them but the plan is to like maybe hang some funny kits up here some scarves and stuff and um just try to make this room as cool as possible but i love like the turf on the wall it looks in my opinion, it looks sick. Let me know in the comments what you guys think. We are back. FIFA 21 player rewind on Thierry Henry. Starting him back at the club. He began his career on Monaco. My man Thierry Henry is going to be coaching for Belgium in the Euros. But it's time to take him to glory back as a player. Bro, his, his like head is covering up part of his name. So we got him at 75 overall. And uh, we will... Start with the development plan, but before we do that, boys, we got a special message for a sponsor of this video. So, boys, we got the Euros coming up next week, and to get you guys prepared, Foot Mob sponsoring the video. It is the best free live football news score highlight apps for you guys to check out. You guys can basically go ahead. So, here's what I have done. I have the USA here as uh, one of my favorite clubs. I'm gonna favorite a few teams. I'll leave the link to Foot Mob in the description. You guys obviously know them. They uh, are. Uh, Big supporters of a ton of the videos on the channel. So, boom. But now I have access to, like, all of the clubs here. So, we're going to have England, Portugal, and France for the Euros. Uh, we're going to have Argentina for the Copa America. I can basically just click on their nations and see when all their next upcoming games are. A really cool feature is the prediction section. Euro 21, Copa America 2021. This is something I think I'm going to do in a future video, so stay tuned for a later video and maybe a few days with my actual predictions. I'm pumped for the Euros. I'm sure you guys are too, so make sure to download the app so you guys can keep up with everything that is going to be going on for this. Um, you know, you can also see the news, other leagues, transfers. They This app literally has everything football related and it's free. Link in the description. Check it out, boys, and let's get back into the video. Cool. Right. Let's uh, get into this right here. So 75 overall. Me and my live stream chats, uh, we, we basically have decided that 75, I've kind of decided this more than the live stream chat. We basically, I basically decided that 75 is the best starting rating for icons because we didn't really know FIFA wasn't really out when they were beginning their career. So we don't really have a true starting overall for them. So for every icon, 75 is kind of where we, we sit them at and then... You guys know the drill. We just play through their career. He's got himself 94 potential. So I'm thinking we start with that poacher. No, let's get his. I want to get his finishing up, but I also want to get his sprint speed up. You know what? Screw it. We're going to start with poacher. We'll work on skill moves and weak foot in like the next seasons. Right. I don't know if he is going to start because they have Ben Yetter. They have Jovic. They have who else? I know they have more players. They have Volin. Oh, this could be a brutal one. You know, we could always change his position. You know, he's played a lot of left wing throughout his career. We have him at striker right now just because that is the icon version of him that we have put into this. I'm really thinking that he could he could be, like, better somewhere else. But I want to keep him as a striker. So that is what we're going to do. Will he play this first season? I don't think he will. All right, whatever. We just got to hope and pray, cross our fingers that he does. So season number one. Oh, man. It's going to be a tough one. Will we play? Will we win anything? I'm going to say the answers to all those are about to be no. All right, boys. Here it is. Season one. The only question is, did we play? And here, here's something that is going to be a bit disappointing. Um, we did not make the cup final because in League One, the cup final always takes place at the, uh, at the first week in June. So that's already one L. We're about to get two. Are we about to take back-to-back -back L's here? We are. Fifth place, actually, for Monaco is actually a bit surprising. PSG probably got first. Yeah, PSG. I mean, we, we, were, we were realistically never going to beat PSG. It's always so tough to do in these. But, like, come on, man. Fifth? We didn't even make top four. That's, that's kind of embarrassing. Yeah, I mean, we knew we weren't in the final. We Oh, wow. Such a close one, too. We were definitely the best team out of those four, in my opinion. Ah, that's a waste. That is a waste of a first season. Champions League, dude, Atletico Madrid. We're going to have to go there at some point in this episode. They always win the Champions League. Here is the real moment of truth. Thierry Henry, have you played? He might have. He's got plus one. 
He's only grown three ratings, though. All right, man. Thierry Henry. Has he played? Has he played? Nine games and two goals, bro. I don't know what else I was expecting. I think I was expecting, like, exactly this. That we weren't going to win any trophies. And he wasn't going to play. Why did I not hit loan him out looking back on that? I'm so stupid. Yeah, yeah. Season number two, it is going to be time to get off of this club, Monaco. Listen, I love, I love Monaco. It just... With our rating, we're not fit for the club right now, man. Okay. Yep, 78 overall. Um, Where is he at? Wait, where is he? Oh, there he is. Okay, I just literally passed him. Submitted a loan request. Oh. Oh, no. No, no, no. I want him to I want him to have a transfer request, not a loan request. Literally have never had this happen. Like, I can't remove him. All right, well, I guess we just have to loan him out. I don't, I literally don't know what else to do. Guess, yeah, trading him is the option. Oh my goodness. Jesus. What is it? Who is at my front door? There's someone at my front door. Hold up. I gotta go. Now that I think about this, though, I think this is actually gonna be a good option. We could get some interesting loan offers, and we could loan him to some really interesting clubs that we don't normally go to. So let's just see your options. Worst comes to worst, we trade him. All right. First loan offer comes from Leicester City on a two year loan deal as well. Wow, Thierry Henry to Leicester. Um, chat, how are you guys feeling about this? Should we send him to Leicester? Um, if I would accept this, though, I'd want it to only be a one-year transfer or one-year loan. The chat has spoken, and the chat is saying it's perfect. The chat is saying accept, and then there are the people saying no, bro. We can never have a perfect offer. I don't think I've ever had an offer where everyone in the chat is like, yes, 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 yes. It's always people just arguing in there goes my water bottle all right you know what if i could do this if i could do this on a one a one year let's see can we do one year loan if they accept that i'll do it they have agreed i'm gonna i'm doing it chat i'm accepting it one year lester here's what happens we loan him out to lester he goes there for a year he comes back to monaco and then we can just sell him from there i guess or to be honest once he joins lester we just sign him permanently and we don't even have to worry about it. It is to Leicester City we go. I think this is going to be a great sign in here. All right, so let's see it. Um, They have a what? Yo, I don't even think they have JB Vardy. I think we're just easily the top striker on this team. Yep. Okay, literally. Okay, Lauren. He is a 79 though, so it's very close. But that literally means all we have to do is change to a new formation, which shouldn't be an issue. Need one with two strikers. And I'm not going to lie. Do I even need... Do we need wingers on this team? I mean, they, they have Perez. Um, they have... What is Boateng doing on this team? But hear me out. This is what I have come up with right here. It is a 4-1-2-1-2 wide, okay? But I have, like, kind of customized it. So, obviously, two strikers to fit both of them. We need a cam. We need a left mid and a right mid. And I don't have a CDM. We just have a central midfielder. So it's a little bit more attacking, a little bit less defensive, and then just your normal back line. I don't know. I I think this works, right? Recently, I've been doing these in some seasons, just going so quick and like forgetting to put development styles on my players. So let's not forget to do that. And let's go for complete striker this season. Get the weak, weak foot up to four stars. And you know what? Before we even start, should we just like buy him permanently at the team? I feel like that just make our lives so much easier. I'm gonna do it. All right, I don't. I mean, I, to be honest, I don't know. It pro probably will cost us everything that we have. Let's see. Um. Okay. Yep. Yeah, uh, five hundred million. Sure, he's in. Right. So he's in permanently. Signed for fifty million, not five hundred million. Uh, Thierry Henry, welcome to the team. And now we can simulate the season. Okay. Let's do this. Let's uh. Let's get. You know what? No. I was gonna say let's get disappointed again. I'm ready. I'm ready for Leicester to maybe pop off in like Europa League or FA Cup or something. How about that? How about that? <sighs> Fifth place. You know what? Fair enough. We tied Spurs on points. Was Leicester really ever realistically going to win the league? No. Fifth place. First place was Liverpool. Of course it was Liverpool. It's always Liverpool. It's always Liverpool there too. Watch Liverpool again. Oh, no Spurs. Right. Oh, Thierry Henry, man. All right. Let's get to that point. We need we need to start winning something. We need we need to start doing something, man. Wow, we almost did something, but Spurs prevented us. Europa League semifinals, man. We got so close on that one. And eighty-four. 
Wait, hold up. Did he just grow six ratings? He was 78, and he's up to 84. Okay. Thierry Henry is on track. Let's go. That, like, with a rating like that, that genuinely moves, we can move to a massive club next season. They're saying 20 goals in the chat. I'm going to predict. Okay, 20 goals. How, Bro, how do you guys see this stuff, man? Literally, someone in my chat said, says 20 goals. Boom, 20 goals dead on. This dude is knows more about this save than I do. What the hell? Okay. That is an insane season, though. Yeah, yeah. So into season number three, people are saying, before move moved to a small club, you're going to grow. No. First off, we're 84 overall, right? Perfect rating to win trophies. These next three years, I want to go to three massive clubs where we have a chance to win the Champions League every season. Also, as we get to this season, uh, just another reminder, download FootMob link in the top line of the description. Sponsor in this video. Check out everything on there for the new transfers that are gonna be coming up. Highlights, Euro highlights. Uh, obviously that competition is gonna be coming soon. So link in the description. And now it is time. He's on the club permanently. He's on the transfer list. Thierry Henry, 19 years old. The man's already 84 overall. That's actually insane. Oh God, and I can't even imagine what this is. People in the chat were asking for potential. Okay, yep, it is. Uh, oh my goodness, man. Yep. We started at 94 potential. He is at 99 potential. That is insane i can't even imagine what this is uh about to look like right here man oh good god all right let's see it and by that i mean like i can't imagine what transfer offers we're going to get apparently none here we go up for number one and it is Real Madrid, and it involves eden hazard in a trade deal oh boy Real madrid Real madrid real madrid should we take him to Real Madrid? Do I dare even ask the chat? Do I dare even get their opinion? I'm going to. People are saying, no, don't do it. You'll become a snake. First off, this is a video game, man. Like, I can do whatever the heck I want. This isn't real life. If I'm a snake, I'm a snake. Someone said before, trust me. No, don't do it. You know what? I'll trust you. But if Real Madrid win the Champions League next season, I'm coming back to that comment and finding you in my chat, all right? Give me something big here, boys. Come on. Let's go. Ooh, no. Oh, no. We did get one. Leipzig. No. I, I can't do Leipzig. Tyrion. Okay, yep. This one we have to. This one we freaking have to. Bro, I keep getting alerts that there's someone at my front door. There is no one at my front door. All right. This is accepted in a heartbeat. We just got to negotiate the offer. Atletico Madrid dominates for whatever reason. We have to go here. Usually we have success at this club. So here we go to the Madrid of Atletico, as someone in my chat said. And this team still has Suarez. Felix is at striker. They have Weghorst. And we, uh, from the looks of it, will most likely definitely be starting on this team, actually. Team could use, like, a CDM, though, maybe. Do they have a CDM? No, they could really use a few more pieces. They have freaking Billy Gilmore on this team. Um, no, overall, it looks like a it looks like a really decent team. I'm not gonna lie though. I think Real Madrid would have been better. And looking at this team now, I'm really mad that we didn't accept the Real Madrid. Someone said, "Bro, why is someone twerking on your TV?" I have this on a 10-hour meme compilation, so I have literally no control over anything that is happening right now on this screen like no nothing nothing at all okay Thierry Henry let's get my man up to five star five star and let's have a dominant season number three let's sim this season so boys what is this the end of is this the end of this is season three correct I feel like this has been a really long episode so far there's been a lot going on here we go if Atletico Madrid finishes lower than Real Madrid, I'm going to be so mad. I really am. I really am. We got first, though. Okay, I didn't think we could do it with that team, but we did. Trophy number one has been achieved. What about trophy number two? No. The El Clasico final, we lose. We lost to Real Madrid. Unlucky. You know what? I, I'm fine. I'll take one trophy, maybe two, though. We actually did it. Oh, my god and look who we beat in the final oh my god i can't believe that bro we beat real madrid in the final too <laughs> let's go man we go from zero trophies to winning two of the biggest trophies in the world in one season holy freaking w i'm actually so stoked on that and tiarant 
Dude, he's growing plus six every season. He's up to a 90 overall with two seasons left. Dude, we need to do more of these on icons because like they just dominate. These are so much fun to do on icons. 21 goals, only one assist, which is a little disappointing. But you know what? I can't be too upset. We we won the Champions League, man. Yeah, yeah. Into season number four. You would think that we'd want to stay on the club that just won the Champions League, right? Yes, we probably should, but I'm not going to because, I don't know, it's more fun when you go to one new club every season, right? That's usually the way we do it. Cool, right, yep, I'm sorry, Atletico Madrid, it's just, it's just gotta be done, man. It's gotta be done. We gotta keep moving around, you know, keep going to, to hopefully bigger and better teams. Oh man, I just don't know where we'd go next, to be honest, it could be better than this. One thing I will say that is good in one of the reasons I, I, I will be moving is because we don't sign players. We are just controlling the player. We don't improve the Atletico Madrid team. And other teams are improving. So that's kind of the only benefit I would say there is to leaving after every season. I'm not going to lie. I'm going to miss the Felix combo with Thierry Henry, though. I, man, that was just deadly. Like, what do we have? We had 40-something combined goals. Absolute madness. And no one's offering for Thierry Henry. What? Come on, man. Someone. Can we get an offer here? Hello? All right, man. Um, there it is. Okay, finally, we get one. <laughs> what is this, bros? Wolves? Hello? Wolves. That is such a random one to get at this point in the career mode. I mean, I, I love it, but they're not going to win the Champions League, so I can't accept it, obviously. If Wolves actually, if we, like, we just rejected them, if they actually go on to win the Champions League, in this next upcoming season, I would literally shave my head right here on camera, man. I will 100% do it. Here's a better one. Let's do it. Let's go to, um, let's do it. Why not? Bayern Munich, boys. Thierry Henry to Germany. I feel like it fits. Let's accept it. All right, here it is. This is the Bayern Munich transfer offer. Uh, we haven't been here in a, a while, maybe. Has it been? It feels like for me, it's been a while since we moved to this club in a rewind. They have Aubameyang at striker. Okay, uh, that's good for us. I mean, I, I think we're going to start regardless. Like, it, I would be shocked if they had someone higher rate. Wow, this team has a lot of players, man. A big boy Conte in here. They got our former teammate at Leicester in here, who's, I can't pronounce his name for the life of me. Pulisic, who unfortunately isn't going to start because I'm, I'm going to throw Sané in there. This team, oh, they have... Oh, I forgot. We have other icons in the game, boys. They have Icon Schmeichel in this team. Neuer isn't even going to play. I always forget to, like, bring that up. But, hey, you can even see right here. Oh, man. And I have to explain this, too. Right. So, you guys know, to get icons in the career mode, you have to put every icon in. You can't just really put one. In the squad sheets that I loaded in for this one, it's funny because it has every three has all three icon versions of every player so it has like it had samuelettos like prime icon his middle icon and his baby icon same for Thierry Henry too actually I actually really want to see this because there should be multiple Thierry Henry's yep look at this there's a total of three Thierry Henry's obviously this one is our Thierry Henry the other two are 45 though and still playing this one is a free agent I mean if I really wanted to I could just sign another Thierry Henry to this team right now i'm not going to but i could all right one more thing we do before we sim this second to last season is the development plan man what do, let's do target man we haven't done that one yet i don't know man with the way we've been going we might actually get him up to a 99 overall if we keep having insane seasons like we have been so hopefully we can keep that streak alive Bayern munich what are we saying i think that this has potential the team looked insane i think we will have done really well so let's find out here we go the league has been... Oh, my God. It wasn't even close. I mean, I don't know what else I was expecting. We were by far the best team, man. I have, like, a feeling, though, that we could have potential for a treble this season. Here we go. League Cup. Oh, my goodness, man. Let's go. Beating Dortmund 3-0 for the treble. Could you imagine the scenes? We've actually done it. Oh, my God. Dude, I'm not going to lie. It has been months since we've won the treble on a player rewind. Dudes, to anyone who was saying that Bayern Munich was gonna be an L of a club, uh, Thierry Henry has just proved everyone wrong. We beat Real Madrid two years in a row in the final. That is a madness. We have just done an absolute madness, boys. Let me see them dub spams in the chat. Let's go. I gotta see it, man. I'm used to the Ls. 
Show me, show me them big dubs, chat. Let me see them dubs. There it is. Love it. You love to see it, boys. I just want to keep looking at it, man. I just want to sit here and keep looking at this beautiful result. I right, can't do that. Tyrion Reed only grew three. Okay. That is a bit disappointing, but I'm not. We won the treble. Why am I trying to find an excuse to be disappointed, boys? Like, what a season. I mean, look at that. How? I'm so confused. Other seasons, we go, we grow plus six with scoring 20 goals. And we have our best season yet. And we have our worst growth yet. I'm, like, so confused. Yeah, yeah. So this is going to be interesting going into the last season, man. We have had one hell of an episode. To be honest, no matter what happens in this last season... I mean, it really doesn't matter. It's been like a massive success. So this is actually going to be a really interesting decision. Tier Henry up to a 94. Nice. I could go to like a small club since this has already been a super successful video. But I want to keep going to big clubs. I want to see just how much we can win. Imagine. Imagine we win three straight Champions League finals in a row. I guess we just see who's offer offers for us. I have a feeling a lot of people are going to be wanting us. All right. Two offers coming from Manchester United and liverpool man we need to accept one of these i just don't don't know which one to accept man oh chat this is on you you guys get to pick the last season what are we saying i'm going with one of the two it's liverpool or united so chat tell me this is why we don't make these realistic because Thierry and at either of these clubs is just it's just disrespectful but i'm doing it i don't care ah oh, i think people are saying liverpool i think people are saying liverpool yes it's being done I guess we have to do it. I don't know, man. Oh, I'm doing it. I'm doing Liverpool. I've accepted it. I'm sorry. It's done. Lock it in for Liverpool. Here it is, boys. Let's do it. Okay. We have won the Champions League two seasons in a row. Can we make it three? And to be honest, they have Lewa. There's not really much to do in this, uh, this final season, except like, well, obviously we need to change the formation and make sure we're the starting striker. This team has a lot of good players. Wow, I'm actually kind of surprised. One of our former teammates in Saul is still on this club right here. He's going to be in for Henderson, I guess. Origi is at left wing. That's going to have to change. Um, Chavi Simmons is on this team. That's kind of wild. Let's go for you. Really don't know how I feel about this team, boys. I, uh, I don't know. Thierry Henry, bros. If you could win the Champions League this year, I think this genuinely might be the best rewind of all time no pressure let's do oh god um poacher target man we really didn't grow last year i'm gonna go with that here Henry, no pressure it's just for a chance at being the best rewind player ever ever made so no pressure here we go i'm so nervous man here we go oh boy you know what on the tv we got the doge back here for some good luck here we go oh man okay what are we at we're at like five trophies um, i just want the champions league that's it first off for the league of course of course it's the other team that we could have went to oh my god boys dude it was literally one point literally one point and look at that lester the team that we were on earlier wait hold up where's Thierry Henry's former club arsenal oh god all the way down to ninth good thing we didn't go there have they come Wolves, another club that we could have went to that we got an offer from. Kirbyo Cup. Southampton, are we... Oh, dude, we might not win anything. Please. We lost in the final, man. He couldn't do it. You know what? A big round of applause to Thierry Henry in three straight Champions League finals. Oh, we lose to our former club, Atletico Madrid. Boys, what an episode. This will still go down as one of the best rewinds we may have ever done. I mean, just incredible work. 28 goals, 7 assists. Here are the final results. We have ourselves a total of 95 overall, 105 goals, 17 assists, 5 trophies. If there was a Hall of Fame for rewinds, Thierry Henry would be in it. This was an incredible episode. There it is. Thierry Henry, what a player, what an episode. Boys, thank you guys so much for watching. Chat, say goodbye to the the youtube chat i guess um yo big news as well uh my player dropping this friday it is coming back to the channel um also make sure you guys download foot mob link in the description check out the merch still live if you guys want to get some link that is in the description as well appreciate you guys watching and with that we'll catch you guys later peace I need